Scott, ultimately a victory for Canada. Talk about that intense battle out there. Yeah, it was, it was um, I think, a pretty intense battle. I thought we started pretty well um, and obviously scored, uh, I think, in the first 10 minutes there, which was good, and we were playing well. I think we kind of, a little bit of them lifting it a bit and then us kind of going back a bit on our heels when we maybe didn't really need to and, and kind of got away from some things we had talked about before the game. But I think no matter who we're playing, um, a semifinal is a semifinal and the kind of tension in the game causes that to happen. And I think it maybe wasn't the prettiest game to watch. It was probably pretty uh, sort of gritty and scrappy, but at the same time, sometimes those are nice games to play as well. You guys met USA in the 2013 Pan Am Cup semifinals and went to a shootout, so a bit of familiar territory there for you? Um, yeah, I mean, we have a, a pretty good rivalry. I know we've traditionally come out on top, um, but it's I think this is, for me, the best USA team I've ever played against. Um, and, and we knew it was going to be a difficult game to play, so I, I'm pretty happy uh, that we were able to get the result and t to grind out the, uh, the tie when I think we weren't really firing on all cylinders and they did get some chances sort of towards the goal late. Um, and then to get into the shootout, I think we're quite confident there. We're, I think, 5-for-5 five five now in, in tournaments. So, um, yeah, all in all, it's maybe not the prettiest, but uh, a good win nonetheless. Yeah, and you talk about being, having that success in shootouts. And talk a little bit about not only uh, Carter in, in goal, but also some of the youngsters that have come up to, to put you guys in those positions where you can actually win in shootouts. Yeah, yeah, I, uh, I steer clear of them these days. But, um, yeah, I think Dave, everyone really, really knows that Dave's world class in the shootout and his sort of... Um, Maybe not so traditional technique, but his pure athleticism, the way he's always able to get behind the ball, it, he, we know he's usually good for two saves. And I think in shootouts, if you can consistently do that, you're going to get wins. And, and for the guys, they, they show some pretty slick skills and, and also Flores just walking up and hammering it to win. Um, that's awesome for us when you can get guys that are newer into the group that can put their hand up and confidently walk up and... and put the ball in the net like they did, um, that, that's good for any program. Well, a gritty finish, as you say, so good job tonight and good luck in the final. Thanks, Ali.